Hey guys, this is Better Phrasers again, and today I'll be showing you how to uh, set up Cydia after you've jailbroken for the best results to be able to download the most things. And in my previous video, I showed you how to jailbreak with Spirit up to 3.1.3 .3, or with jailbreakme.com up to 4.0.1. But after you've jailbroken your iPod Touch or iPhone by following my video, just turn it on. Newly jailbroken. Now go into that app right there that you get when you jailbreak. It's called Cydia. Now you'll get this prompt right here. Whenever Cydia crashes for the first time and then you go back into it and just if you're worried about what you will be able to download and you want to be able to download the most just pick developer no filters and that is what I would highly suggest and then just let city load this can take a while depending on your device but you don't necessarily have to uh, let it load it, everything just goes faster if you do let it load though just wait until there's no black bar right there it's going to reload the data after it's finished Sorry, I had auto lock on. But after the data reloads, which might take a while, it takes longer your first time. Now, what I would recommend for this is complete upgrade because you'll get a lot of crashes, bugs, errors, things like that if you don't upgrade. So just complete upgrade. Don't put it off until whenever. Just do it as soon as possible. And tap confirm. And it'll bring up all these things like this. It may take a while depending on your connection. And if I remember correctly, then your iPod or iPhone has to reboot after this first upgrade. Oh no! You just it just closes Cydia. So just click that button. And it goes straight back into it. And then after that, you can just basically add all the sources you want. Uh, I'll put a couple of sources that I like the best in the description. But I hope this helped all of you that are looking to jailbreak. And if this did help you, then please comment, rate, and subscribe.